Uh, good morning lads, um, welcome back to another episode of the M50 B30 Stroker build. Um, my replacement piston ring came during the week, so I got the last piston installed and all torqued down. Uh, so the block is basically all built up now, rotating assembly is all done and torqued to spec. Uh, next on the list, uh, which I'm going to do today, is get the oil pump on, front timing case, um, hopefully get the head gasket on and get that torqued down as well. Uh, so I'll show you the block as it sits. As you can see, um, all pistons are in. Block rotates nice and freely. Um, so I'm going to get the rest of the bits on and I'll uh, show you a bit of that. Alright, uh, so um, basically oil pump is on, uh, front timing case, baffle plate. I didn't get time to put the head on today. Um, I had some problems with the M50 baffle plate. It doesn't clear the rod bolts from the M54. Um, so I slightly touches them, so what I needed to do was space that out, so that's done and fitted. Um, oil pump is on. I'm just using a standard M50 oil pump, um, but I would recommend getting an upgraded oil pump if you are going to do this, uh, just to save costs in the long run in case it breaks. Um, I'm just going to wire the nut um, onto the oil pump uh, wheel, onto the oil pump sprocket, and hopefully that will stop it from backing off, but um, I don't know. Um, Alex at Hopwood Motorsport, he'll be able to sort you out with a good pump if you want to get in contact with him. Um, that's where I've got all, all the internal engine bits off, bolts and so on so far. Um, I'll put his link in the description of the video. Um, so I'll give you a quick look at the block. Uh, so that's basically how we're sitting at the moment. As you can see, oil pump everything is on. Um, this is the nut I'll drill. And then um, wire to the sprocket because um, this is reverse thread and obviously you can back off. Um, as I said, Alex, um, I hope a motorsport heat is an upgraded version um, and which should last a lot longer than the standard one. Uh, just to show you the sump plate, if you can see that it's just been spaced out with some washers to clear and now it rotates freely. Um, other than that, that's basically it for this week. Um, as I said, I didn't get much done. Um, because the baffle plate slowed me down, I was trying to work out what was the best way to get that fitted and there wasn't much information online on what people have done with it. Uh, the M52 one was completely wrong, so that wouldn't fit. Um, next now is basically just to get the head on. Um, and once you get the head on, get the cams in, get it all timed up, get the sump on, um, and that'll be basically it. So hopefully I'll get most of that done next weekend. As I said, um, I don't do much in the week with it. There's a bit of stuff. Um, uh, hopefully you enjoy watching and um, subscribe and like the videos. Thanks.